Welcome to a proof of the theorem that states two lines parallel to a third line are parallel. So we want to prove that if line L is parallel to line M and M is parallel to line N, then it follows that L is also parallel to N. Let's see if we can outline a strategy. We know if L and M are parallel, then corresponding angles are congruent. So we could say that angle two is congruent to angle six. So looking at lines M and N, notice that angle six corresponds to angle 10. So angle six would be congruent to angle 10. And therefore, by the transitive property, it follows that angle two is congruent to angle 10, and therefore L is parallel to N. So let's go ahead and write this out. So number one, we'll state the given. L is parallel to M, and M is parallel to N. Step two, angle two is congruent to angle six. This is by the corresponding angle postulate. And there are a lot of ways to abbreviate here, it depends on your instructor. Then looking at lines M and N, angle six would be congruent to angle 10. For the same reason, the corresponding angle postulate And now we can state that angle two is congruent to angle 10. Notice they're connected by both being congruent to angle six. This should have been step three. So the reason for step four would be the transitive property. And then step five, if angle two is congruent to angle 10, we can conclude that line L is parallel to line N, and this is by the corresponding angle converse postulate. And now we have it. I hope you found this example helpful.